Hello, and welcome to Boom Master. This is a product that has just hit the market, and we're really excited about it. It's for the iPad exclusively. So let's get started. First of all, download Boom Master from the App Store, then hit the Boom Master icon. When it loads up, it's automatically going to power up. The main thing you want to do right out of the gate is load some music. So why don't we do that? By hitting the eject button, what happens is you get to create a sweet mixtape from your music that's already in your iPod collection. You can search by songs, by albums, you name it. Let's grab a few different things. Let's say we wanted to have a few of uh, a few of Johnny Cash's best songs. You can select those just by doing that. Then let's go and grab a few more. Uh, maybe by artist. Let's say we wanted to pick something by Air France. Perhaps by Beck. And then you hit done. That actually creates the music, the actual mixtape. So once we want to actually start to hit play, all you do is hit the play button. Hello, I'm Johnny Cash. All right. So the music has started. Now let's say you didn't really like the volume that you had. Now the key is here that you want to hold with two fingers around the volume button. If you want to raise it up, you want to lower it. And that's the same with the tuner. There are a few features here that are just for fun and bells and whistles. Uh, for instance, the tuner rotates the same way. You use two fingers to rotate it back and forth. Okay. If you want to hit forward, simply hit the forward button. Let's say we want to get out of Johnny Cash for a second here. No offense, Johnny. We've landed on a new type of song. All right, sweet. So we have our music that we're pretty happy with. Notice that the music's actually pumping out through the speakers. Let's say we want to raise the handlebar. All you do is hit the button for handle. It's over near the left. Antenna. It's the same way. And then of course there's the secondary antenna. Perfect. Okay. Well let's say we want to stop it. We just hit stop. You can hit play again. And you'll pick up from where you left off. Same, same thing with the pause button. All right. So one other big feature about this device is that you can also turn it vertically. By turning it vertically, what you're doing is you're allowing it to access just the major big speaker. If you wish to lock the device so that the screen is fixed, whether you hold it vertically or horizontally, hit the screen lock feature on your iPad. So those are the main features. We'll update this from time to time, but I just wanted to give you a sense of it. So thank you very much from the Gorilla Group, and enjoy.